you're single and looking for adventure, or just a solo traveler wanting to mingle with other like-minded folks, we've got some suggestions for you. Kathleen Roldon, the director of dating for Match.com, has found three sites that can help you plan your next trip. Welcome to the show, Kathleen. Thank you. Director of dating, are you guys still looking for a chief executive love bunny? <laughs> That's great. I like that. You're not using that title yet? Not yet. All right. Well, okay. Are you interested? No, I got this. This is a good gig. Okay. I really like this. So you, you guys have put together vacations that aren't just like regular vacations. How are they different? Well, this is a great new site. Match.com has launched matchtravel.com. It's vacation packages that are specifically geared towards singles or people traveling by themselves. What about it, uh, the age groups? Is it just for younger people, older people? It's all age ranges, all interests. We have um, a a weekend coming up for people in their 20s and 30s, and then we have a fall foliage cruise that's for seniors. So wow. it's a big range. And you've recommended other sites that don't belong to Match.com. Mm -hmm. The first of which being JewishTravel.com. Now, what right. can we find here? Well, this is another travel site. It is um, has a range of trips, but what I liked about this is it has a section for singles. So you can actually click on singles, and here's a trip coming up in October um, in Nepal. The Himalayan Adventure. There you go. Now, this is, this is going to be geared towards those who are interested in the Jewish culture. Would you have right. to be Jewish in order to take part of the trip? Not necessarily, but it's um, definitely geared toward um, Jewish travelers, and this particular trip is for singles. Okay. So. Well, let's take a look at what you guys are doing there at matchtravel.com. A lot of stuff. In fact, you, you've got a, a wonderful way after it pulls up here. Uh, mm -hmm. There's something apparently coming up on Labor Day, but you have a whole bunch of upcoming trips. Right, but, and we have them uh, listed out by month, so depending on what month you want to travel in, here, here are our trips for August. All the good options. Now, what's the coolest trip that you think is coming up? Well, I like this one. We have great partners, and one is REI, and there's this trip to Ireland, and it's a cycling adventure. Woohoo! And it's coming up pretty soon. And this is this, uh, what kind of age range is this going to be geared towards? Oh, this is any ages. As long as you're a single or solo traveler, um, you can book this through the site. And do you have to be a Match.com member in order to use no, this? No, you don't. In fact, as long as you're a single person traveling, you just log on to MatchTravel.com and find something that's of interest for you. Uh, all right. So what if you were on one coast and your interest was on another coast? What kind of resource would you recommend using? Right. Well, that's the great thing is you'll go on these trips and you'll there's a lot of interactive activities. You'll meet other people and they're not necessarily from where you're located. So here's a site, Expedia.com. I think a lot of people are familiar with mm -hmm. that you can book a trip. Say you're in Seattle and the person you met it lives in Atlanta. You can find a um, a trip instantly at and um, or let's say you want to meet some at a neutral location. Um, you can pick a trip. They, they have a trip for Las Vegas, and you can uh, book your flight there. It's calling me, you know. Las, Las Vegas. Vegas. <laughs> I keep watching the commercials, and I, it keeps calling me, and I thought it, I just should ignore the voice in my head, but... I've never been. Have really? You been? You've never been to Vegas? No. Oh, my gosh. You're the director of dating, and you've never been to Vegas. <laughs> oh, go don't, for the buffets. Don't tell anyone. Go for the buffets. Really? Oh, yeah. It's, I eat bacon, like, oh, it's, it's one. And there's good people <laughs> there, too, and all sorts of fun stuff. Uh, I thought, too, it was kind of funny, the one-way trips, it's for the daring individuals. Right. If you are really excited about the person you met, just book a one-way trip <laughs> yeah. and be your set. Well, Kathleen, thank you so much well, for coming you. in. We do appreciate it. And of okay. course, for more of Kathleen's wonderful suggestions, why don't you head over to our website where she's posted them. That, of course, is at techtv.com slash call for help.